Hello everyone, my name is Liz and this is Art Fart and today we are going to be reading The Art Teacher from the Black Lagoon. If it sounds scary, it's because it is. Alright, let's get started. This book was written by Mike Thaler and the pictures are by Jared Lee and as an art teacher you definitely want to say who illustrated the book. Today, I have my first art class. Look, there's a little puppy. The teacher's name is Crayola Swamp. The kids call her the Glitter Queen because she leaves a trail of sparkles wherever she goes. They say sometimes she makes her dresses out of egg cartons, her jewelry out of pipe cleaners, and her hats out of paper plates. Ooh. She wears a long ponytail that she paints with, and she has a big weasel that she paints on. Her room is supposed to be a recycling dump. Goodness, it doesn't seem like a very smart idea to paint with your ponytail. Might be kind of hard to get the paint out. And her closets, forget it. They're still looking for a kid who opened one. They say she tells you to express yourself. I want to draw dinosaurs biting each other's heads off. But she makes you draw flowers, clouds, and other girl stuff. I don't know. I think flowers and clouds can be cool. And they say you have to paint with your fingers. Gross. I'm wearing gloves. And then she makes you paint with your feet. Some kids will never have to wear socks again. I don't know. I think some kids would like that, especially on Stinky Feet Day. You can really slop around because there's pig mint and styrofoam everywhere. Some kids throw paint and have Tempera tantrums. Oh my gosh, what a pigsty. On Valentine's Day, you have to cut out hearts. That could get messy. Then there's the clay. That's really messy and squishy. She puts you on a wheel and spins you around until you're frizzy and dizzy. Oh my, I think you're supposed to do that with the clay, not with your students. Then she sticks you in an oven and fires you. Can I get fired from school? They say that you come out of her class with a real glazed look. Man, that kid has seen some things. Then there's mobiles. Some kids are still hanging around her room. A kid named Art and a kid named Matt got framed and hung on the wall. They say she has pots full of glue, and some kids end up sticking to their projects for a long time. I heard you learn how to fold cookies into different shapes. It's called Oreogami. I'm pretty sure that's origami. And then you have to learn about artists. There was a whole bunch of them, and they were all a little weird. One artist lay on his back for four years and painted a ceiling. He should have used a roller. It would have been much quicker. Do you guys know who that artist is? If you guessed Michelangelo, you guessed right. And there's another guy who cut off his ear and mailed it to Erie, Pennsylvania. Their paintings are weird, too. This, this one guy named Dolly painted wacky watches. Oh my, I think their information's a little off. Do you know who he is? He is Vincent Van Gogh. And this guy here is Salvador Dali. They're both famous artists. And a guy named P. Katzo painted melted Martians. But most of them just painted their own thumbs. 
Ooh, do you know who this artist actually is? It sounds close to Peacat, so it's Picasso. My dad says people become artists because they can't get regular jobs. Well, it's time to go to art class. We march in. I don't know, do the kids look excited to go in? They look a little scared. Wow, there's a big rainbow on the wall. It's awesome. Miss Swamp says we can use every color in it. I'm going to paint rainbow dinosaurs biting each other's heads off. Look at that! She doesn't look anything like the monster she thought they thought she was going to be. And he even got to paint what he wanted. I'm going to love art. Maybe I'll even be an artist someday. There he is with his doggy and an unknown animal that I assume is a pig. All right, that was the art teacher from the Black Lagoon. I myself was fortunate enough to be an art teacher and I loved every second of it. And if you're watching this now, I hope you have an excellent art class today. Bye-bye!